Here's something you might want to consider if you live in an area where you are conserving water. And that would, of course, be a fountain like this with a pool with something spraying up and splashing out. I mean, look at how far away this is. Look at this. It's all over here. And uh, you can even see the waves in here. It's nice. Uh, got a nice ripply pattern going in here so who knows how much of the water is splashing up and out or actually just splashing over the edge for something like this so if you are going to build a fountain and trust me i love to see these fountains i love to sit by them i love them more probably than anyone else but uh, they do waste a lot of water and that's kind of the reason why I'm making this video just to throw that out there if you have a fountain like this maybe you can slow the water down maybe you can use one jet maybe you can cap off a couple of these lower the water pressure something like that to conserve water if you need to so again the reason why I'm making the video is just to point out uh, some people are not aware they really are not aware of how much water a fountain like this with a pool can actually waste due to splashing out um, the water splashing out somehow or simply just through evap evaporation on a warm day.